So then finally, once they have the caterpillars have gone through the change in the chrysalis or pupa, the butterfly emerges, dries its wings, and then flies off to seek out a mate. And then once that happens, the butterflies lay their eggs and the cycle starts again. So as you can clearly see, this is a very um, simple life cycle. Um, where we have, of course, the egg, the caterpillar, chrysalis pupa, and the butterfly. So, some interesting facts about these butterflies, okay. Butterflies taste with their feet. Butterflies are actually cold-blooded, so they are um, the same as um, reptiles, and they can't fly or function properly if their body temperature falls below 13 degrees. So you could say that um, you may sort of think about when you see butterflies and you probably see them when um, the weather is very, very warm. Um, but obviously here the weather's very, very warm all the time. So they're probably, um, you probably see them most of the year. Um, butterflies mostly live on liquid from nectar. So, um, so that comes from the plants, or even things like animal dung, so they get some nutrients from that. Um, the only thing with butterflies is they only tend to live for two to four weeks after emerging from their chrysalis. So they're only alive for a couple of weeks, lay their eggs, and then unfortunately they die.